So today's a special day because we're going to Gold's Gym. If you guys have been staying in touch with me on Discord and Instagram, I'm in Milan right now for like business stuff. And just getting opportunities and making stuff happen because that's kind of what this job is. I'm fucking excited. Like straight up, I'm just excited. So we're in gold right now. This is literally the first time I've ever been in gold. This is fucking insane. It's obviously the Milan version. It's not fucking Los Angeles. But bro, like this shit's lit. My teenage self is just fucking freaking out right now because I used to like watch all the guys train at gold and make content and shoot videos and like be aesthetic. I was just like, I was like the kid to be like, holy shit, like one day I'm gonna be at gold and it's gonna be like, like how I thought. And like I'm living that right now. So I just like, bro, I'm just trying to relish it in. Like I'm really trying to like live like the fruits of my labor, of my physique, of, of my content, of like all the work I've put in. And obviously it's just the gym, right? But Gold's Gym, like it just means something to me like personally. And I think it just, for a lot of people that also come here that love bodybuilding, love doing fitness and shit. So um, I would just leave it less for the words and more about the action today. And we're gonna get some great content for you guys. It's gonna be lit, bro. And yeah. Thank you, stay tuned, let's go. Alright guys, Gold's Gym is exactly how you guys think it is. It's fucking lit. 10 out of 10 workout, the posing rooms, like fucking, everything was fucking lit. I honestly loved it. Me and Nick are a little drained right now because we've been here like for three and a half hours or something. Yeah, yeah, something like this. Yeah, it's... like he was, I was getting him to take the pictures of me and he was like, he's like, bro, I can't do this anymore. Okay. <laughs> we literally destroyed it. Yeah, we destroyed our rooms, bro. Like, try this workout if you love your mom. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Like, that's it. And I came back here and this fucking guy said hi to him. And he acted like I just killed his wife. And he's like, he's like, do you have a problem? I was like, hi. We say hi when we come in the gym. 
So that kind of pissed me off, but I'm trying to cool down. Oh, That's it, jungle. though. kid is really hungry. He's really fucking hungry. How's Los Angeles? Like you're finally in California. How does it feel? <laughs> <laughs> How's <Wow>. Bali? Tenerife? <laughs> I wanted to say something really quickly because me and Nick were just talking about the little incident I had there. And I've had this before. When somebody older than you like kind of has a shitty attitude, anyone in general, but like especially the older people, I'm speaking to the young people specifically, like it kind of, like it kind of, you're just like, what the fuck was that, right? Like you have like a little moment. Bro. It's all in your head. You know what I'm saying? Like just stay, stay chill. It's going to be fucking okay. Just let things go and move on. But a lot of people aren't going to like you. And maybe it's a little incident like that can, that can try to like take down your vibe or whatever it is. Put you in a shitty mood because they like say something stupid or you... You guys don't agree on something or there's like an incident there's always something but the key is the i feel like it's really to just be like oh well i don't care because there's going to be a lot of that in your life when you're doing something different so i just want to say that let's fucking go bro <laughs>